Hi, this is Sarah Thur. I'm a project manager at Influence, and for this tour, I'm also the captain of the Australian bobsled team, the winners of the 2014 Influence API Hackathon. The hackathon was presented at the 2014 Influence Marketing Platform User Conference. Audience members at the conference saw demos from four teams and at the end of the day voted for their favorite use of the new marketing platform API. I teamed up with our SEO strategist, Tyler Barnes, and our developer, Jacob Schwartz, and after a few brainstorming sessions, we ultimately decided to create a lead scoring app, which would provide marketers a list of their brand champions based on email engagement. At its most basic level, this list could be used to remarket to or upsell to your most engaged customers, to provide your salesman with a list of hot leads that he should be calling, or even tell you which segment of your audience would be most likely to provide feedback on a product or customer service survey. So without further ado, welcome to the Influence Lead Scoring app. To get started, all you need is your Influence account API key, which you can get either from your account manager or by emailing support at influence.com. Once you enter your API key, the app is going to start making calls to your platform account and aggregating the engagement scores of all of your available contact records. Our team established a preset scoring system where opens, clicks, forwards, and shares are each worth a specific score. For instance, an open is worth 5 points, but each click is worth 20 points. Once the report's done running, you can click into a specific contact record for a quick view of their engagement data, to quickly grab their phone number, and to see which groups they're in if you want to know what kind of emails they've opted in to receive. You can also click on the contact's name to hop over into their contact record in your Influence account if you want to add or change any data in real time. So, back in the Lead Scoring app, You'll see an Options tab at the top, which, when you click it, opens up a new pane where you can adjust the criteria for your list. From here, you can change the point value of your types of engagement. If, for instance, you're setting up a referral program, you might want to pull a list of your hottest leads by those who forward and share your emails the most, so those items would have higher scores. Ultimately, you and your marketing team will decide what qualifies a hot lead. From here, you can also exclude a specific domain if, say, you want to exclude your internal email addresses from the list. And you can also set the number of results that you'd like returned. So if your salesman comes to you and asks for your top 20 hottest leads from email, you can generate that specific number of results for him. Of course, this app can live on its own site like it does here, or ideally, it would be built into your internal CRM like Salesforce or Microsoft Dynamics so that anyone from your marketing or sales teams can uh, quickly access this email lead data in the system that they're already working in. You can also export your results directly back into your platform account as a new group, or print the results if you want a hard copy to reference or distribute to your salesman as a call list. The PDF of our results includes the contact's name, email address, phone number, a breakdown of their engagement score, and the date that they were added to our database. To show you how the color coding works, I'll expand these results out to 100 contacts. And as you can see here, the top 10 contact records are displayed in red because they are red hot. These are our hottest leads, our brand champions. The next 20 contacts are displayed in orange, and then the remainder are yellow, which are your less engaged or colder leads. All of the criteria and data fields that we've included here can be customized by your developer. Every field in your contact records uh, in your Influence account is available via the API. So if you're collecting demographic data, such as gender, region, or age, you can actually use this app to find out which demographics make up your most engaged audience. This is similar to the demographics data that you can get from social media and Google Analytics tools, and it's just one more weapon in your marketing arsenal that allows you to define your key demographic so you can put the right information or ads in front of them. We'd also love to see someone incorporate uh, conversion data from their e-commerce site into this scoring app because obviously an email is good, a click is better, but a purchase is really the best engagement we can get. This lead scoring app is one example of what you can do with the brand new Influence API. This app is currently available online, so if you're interested in running a report on your contacts, reach out to your account manager or support for a link to the app along with your API key. If you have any questions about what you can do with the new Influence API, reach out to expert at or find us on Twitter at Influence.